poets have been mysteriously silent on the subject of cheese. One sees great things from the valley, only small things from the peak. Literature is a luxury. Fiction is a necessity. Art, like morality, consists of drawing the line somewhere. A woman uses her intelligence to find reasons to support her intuition. The true soldier fights not because he hates what is in front of him, but because he loves what is behind him. I am not absent-minded. It is the presence of mind that makes me unaware of everything else. Fairy tales do not tell children that dragons exist. Children already know that dragons exist. Fairy tales tell children that dragons can be killed. People wonder why the novel is the most popular form of literature. People wonder why it is read more than books of science or books of metaphysics. The reason is very simple. It is merely that the novel is more true than they are. There is the great lesson of Beauty and the Beast that a thing must be loved before it is lovable. The traveler sees what he sees, the tourist sees what he has come to see. The way to love anything is to realize that it may be lost. It is absurd for the evolutionist to complain that it is unthinkable for an admittedly unthinkable god to make everything out of nothing, and then pretend that it is more thinkable that nothing should turn itself into everything. The only way to be sure of catching a train is to miss the one before it. Without education, we are in a horrible and deadly danger of taking educated people seriously. There are no uninteresting things, only uninterested people. I regard golf as an expensive way of playing marbles. Don't ever take a fence down until you know why it was put up. Thieves respect property. They merely wish the property to become their property that they may more perfectly respect it. There are two ways to get enough. One is to continue to accumulate more and more. The other is to desire less. The Bible tells us to love our neighbors and also to love our enemies, probably because generally they are the same people. White is not a mere absence of color. It is a shining and affirmative thing, as fierce as red, as definite as black. God paints in many colors, but he never paints so gorgeously, I had almost said so gaudily, as when he paints in white. The Christian ideal has not been tried and found wanting. It has been found difficult and left untried. Because children have abounding vitality, because they are in spirit fierce and free, therefore they want things repeated and unchanged, 
They always say, do it again, and the grown-up person does it again, until he is nearly dead. For grown-up people are not strong enough to exult in monotony. But perhaps God is strong enough to exult in monotony. It is possible that God says every morning, do it again to the sun, and every evening, do it again to the moon. It may not be automatic necessity that makes all daisies alike. It may be that God makes every daisy separately, but he has never got tired of making them. It may be that he has the eternal appetite of infancy, for we have sinned and grown old, and our father is younger than we. Youth is the period in which a man can be hopeless. The end of every episode is the end of the world. But the power of hoping through everything, the knowledge that the soul survives its adventures, that great inspiration comes to the middle-aged. I would maintain that thanks are the highest form of thought and that gratitude is happiness doubled by wonder. To love means loving the unlovable. To forgive means pardoning the unpardonable. Faith means believing the unbelievable. Hope means hoping when everything seems hopeless. A good novel tells us the truth about its hero, but a bad novel tells us the truth about its author. Do not be so open-minded that your brains fall out. One may understand the cosmos, but never the ego. The self is more distant than any star. An adventure is only an inconvenience rightly considered. An inconvenience is only an adventure wrongly considered. To have a right to do a thing is not at all the same as to be right in doing it. It, feminism, is mixed up with a muddled idea that women are free when they serve their employers but slaves when they help their husbands. If there were no God, there would be no atheists. Drink because you are happy, but never because you are miserable. The word good has many meanings. For example, if a man were to shoot his grandmother at a range of 500 yards, I should call him a good shot, but not necessarily a good man. Religious liberty might be supposed to mean that everybody is free to discuss religion. In practice, it means that hardly anybody is allowed to mention it. Fallacies do not cease to be fallacies because they become fashions. I do not believe in a fate that falls on men, however they act. But I do believe in a fate that falls on them unless they act. The paradox of courage is that a man must be a little careless of his life, even in order to keep it. And when it rains on your parade, look up rather than down. Without the rain, there would be no rainbow. Let a man walk ten miles steadily on a hot summer's day along a dusty English road, and he will soon discover why beer was invented. <laughs>